General clutch mechanism for motorized bike, 80cc, 49cc, motorized bike engine. How this works is this goes inside there and this little pen right there goes in between this part right here goes through that presses on the other side and when you activate your clutch the cam of this part pushes on that bar which in turn pushes on that ball which in turn pushes against this part right here which in turn pushes on this part, releasing your pressure plate. And because it's releasing your pressure plate, the, the engine is able to spin this gear and the bike doesn't go anywhere. And as soon as you let off the clutch, this pressure plate goes back in through spring force from that right there pushing against this pulling on that bar right there which is pulling on this part right here which is clamping this all together transferring power from one side to the other side transferring it into this sprocket driving the bike Um, behind this ring right here is a bunch of ball bearings. The way to get this out is just uh, take a socket and, and just pound it out, but you got to be careful because all these ball bearings will fall out, and the only way to get them back in is to grease the inner and outer race and, and put it in there carefully one by one and try to attempt to pound it back in place without the bearings falling out. That's a very invasive process. It takes anywhere from 30 minutes to two hours to do. Because you're going to be, um, those are going to be popping out one, one by one. So yeah. This is what it looks like with the clutch internals on a dry clutch side taken apart.